now we're, we've dealt everybody two cards, their whole cards. We're gonna get to the betting round. So you're the small blind, which means you put in 500. And the big blind is double that, which is 1,000. I said show them your thousand chip. And now, so those are the only two, unless you have anties, there's the only two bets you're gonna come up with. Small blind and a big blind, okay? We'll talk about the anties in a later bit. Now, the next first act will be Shauna. She'll be the first act since she's the one next to the big blind. So the action goes clockwise, all right? So you got a small, the button, the small blind, the big blind, and then of course you got your first act, always next to the big blind. So she has the option to call the 1,000. Or which to is, raise it. Exactly. Yeah. Or you can save your 1,000 and just fold. fold. So if you give up, you don't get to play, but you don't have to put in a thousand. All right, let's um. So let's do this. Uh, this is not normal, okay? What we're gonna do is we're gonna play with our cards open. So we'll show you how people will bet. Um, let's see those hands. Okay, that's a bad hand. This is an absolutely shitty hand. <laughs> we got the same hand, but we, we're not supposed to know that. So we got king three, king three, seven four, two five off suit. Uh, this is a king three suit of two spades. All right. Um, I think there's a background in. Yeah, yeah seven, right there. Seven. That's a one. That's a one. Yeah. Yeah, we're here to talk about poker, guys. Okay. okay. So now, now, um, so you have the option to call or raise or pull. So let's say you call because of your hand is uh, mediocre right now. So you can call that. She's gonna call a thousand then. Okay. Put in a thousand. So if she calls, she put in a thousand to match the okay. force bet. Okay? My turn, since I have the button, let's say I raise it. I have the option to fold, call, or raise. If I call, I just put in a thousand. But I can raise it. I can challenge them. So I'm gonna raise it to three thousand. Okay, this is basically me challenging, challenging them. Can you call 3,000? Is your hand good enough for 3,000? So now, since I'm done, it's Dave's turn. And I look at my shitty cards and I say, <laughs> what do I say? I say, Putang Taliga. Putang Ya. Putang Ya Taliga. Putang Ya Taliga. Well, what the fuck ever? This is fucking a shitty hand. So I fold. fold it. Yep, and he loses his 500, but he does not need to put in another 2,500. So because my hand's so bad, it's really hard for me to win with that hand. Even if I want to bluff, it's just a really bad hand to start off with. So I'd rather just throw it away and just lose my investment rather than to risk more. Exactly. Exactly. Mm -hmm. All right. So we got. I just thought I was a pretty face, eh? <laughs> Hi, Zach. Yeah. What are you gonna do with that? Let's check your luck. Why did you call? Yeah, this is we're practicing. I'm gonna force Heiza to call. Let's call. <laughs> okay. So to, to call, she needs to match whatever I put in. So she's got a 1,000 there already. She just needs to put in another 2,000 to call. 2,000. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's it. And then it goes around to Shana, who already called. Since I challenged her and said, make it 3,000. She has to call it or fold, so she can still lose the 1,000. If she folds, she loses the 1,000. But since she calls, she's just gonna keep playing, okay? So, that ends the betting round, because it can't go back to me, because I'm the one who raised. I'm the one who set the challenge. So it goes back to me, you know, I already have 3,000 out there. I'm the one who told them, you know, can you do 3,000, and they did. So give me the 3,000, you can't get it back. You cheated. Don't call her a cheater. Don't call my woman a cheater. That's some fighting words, brother. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So our three thousand is going to the pot. So that's nine thousand five hundred going to the pot. And then we're gonna see that. That's the end of the betting round. End of the betting round. So we're gonna see the flop. So we're gonna see the first three cards. Okay. All right. So, we're not supposed to see each other's cards, but right now, exactly. me and uh, Shana just hit the top pair, the highest pair of the board. So, we are ahead. So, the betting round starts after the dealer button. So, who's the first person after the dealer button? It's supposed to be Dave, that he already folded. So, it's on Haiza. Haiza's turn to bet. 
So you have the option now, since there is there a challenge in front of you right now? Is there a bet or a blind no, right? So you have the option to check. When you say check, it's like passing. And I'm pass. I don't want to bet this next person. You can check, you can bet. When you bet, it's like racing. You add more chips in the pot. You challenge us to call a certain amount. But right now you're not gonna do that because you only have a four, pair of four. So you're gonna check. And this is the official sign of check right here. Tapping the table, check. So check. 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 Okay. So once you check, it's gonna be your turn now. So you, since you hit the pair, you're gonna bet. So she has the option to check and make it my turn, or she can she has the option to bet, which is make it higher. That's the two options she has right now. She doesn't want to fold because you don't she doesn't have to call anything, so she has the option. To just check it or bet. So right now you're gonna probably bet. Bet. Okay, do it. Minimum is a thousand. She bets two thousand. And of course I have a king as well, so I know I'm gonna either raise or call. Yeah. In this case, I will issue another challenge to re-raise her. The minimum raise I can do is another two thousand. Because she bet two thousand, I will call it two thousand and raise it another two thousand. Total of four thousand. Okay. So I make it four thousand. And then the action goes around to you. Back to our checker, which is Haiza. She checked earlier. Now you have the option to call. We now we challenge you to call 4,000. So you have the option to call, fold, or re-raise. Okay, but in this case, since you only have the pair of fours, right? And they she's raised and he's re-raised, it's highly likely they're gonna have a king or a jack or two hearts or something. So at this point, you know they have two strong hands, you have the weakest hand. You want to fold at this point. Mm -hmm. So you just say, fuck you. Uh, I fold. Fold. Okay. fold. Actually, you're not supposed to say, fuck you. But... <laughs> All right. So since she's out, the action goes to the original racer now, the original better, which is Shana. And since she has not matched my challenge, which, which is a re-race, she, she has to take a turn. During her turn, she can either call. This is already in, you can't take this back. The 2,000 is already in. You can call, add another 2,000, or re-raise, or fold. If you fold, you lose the 2,000 and I win. Because there's only two of us remaining. So you can call or fold. So most likely you're gonna call, right? For another 2,000. So she calls, matching bets, end of the betting round, right? Yep. So, the next card comes out. So Which what is, is it? it? We have the flop, and then we, we have, have the turn. 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 Yeah. Very good. Oh! oh. oh. The turn card is another king. So we don't know that we both have kings, so at this point, you know, we're going to really bet it out. So, um, it's since the turn came out, it's another betting round. And first to go, since it's to the left of the inner button, going clockwise, it's supposed to be Dave, but he folded. It's supposed to be Haiza, but she folded. So, so it's on Shanna. So she goes first. So I have, if ever you don't know, I'm still going to call. Or you can check. Yeah, you can check. bet. Bet. That's up to you. So since you know you have a good hand, a trio of a kind right yeah. now. Yeah. Actually, this is an extremely strong hand. I'm yep. going to. <laughs> you can go all in. Yeah. There's no limit. You're yeah. all in there. Okay, but but here's the thing, you know, why you want to bet, there's two reasons. Either you want to try to figure out what the other person has. I'm going to, yeah. Uh, or if you think you beat him, right, you want to bet to get more money from him. So you want to bait him. You want to bet just enough so he bets with you because you're pretty sure you're going to beat him. Yeah. But if you bet too much, you'll be scared, so you won't win any more money. Mm -hmm. yeah. But if you just bet a little bit, you know, oh, I'm so scared, there's two kings on the table. What can I do? <laughs> yeah. And then you just... You're just going to pretend. Yes. You're going to pretend that you're scared. Yes. yes. Yeah, pretend you don't have the king. Yeah. You know? Okay. All right. So you're going to bet. It's not bad. So that's uh, 2,500. And um, since I'm, I know I have a good hand, she doesn't know this. So I'm going to probably just, just show you what it looks like all in. So you went all in on Shana. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to re raise you all. And then what are you gonna do? I'm going to. I'm going Scream. to still pretend. 
No need. No need. No need. Because at this point, he's all in. I put his all my chips. So Actually, so he's, doing a, he's doing a great thing. He's put all his so chips in. So I have there. to also be all in. <laughs> yeah. He put you all in. Oh, yes. Can you say that again? All in. You have to say, oh, you put me all in, Ryan. All in, Ryan. No, just say all in, David. Uh, yeah, that's great. Your phone? I know, I know, I just wanted to hear my name. <laughs> <laughs> so what happens is we show the card. So basically I re erase you all my chips and you call. Mm -hmm. You say, ah, I'm good enough, I have to call you. And that's it. Meaning on the fourth well, it's a third betting round, on the third card, we just bet and all our chips went into the pot. We went all in. It's possible, it's no limit. So um since all our chips in the pot, no betting rounds is required anymore. There's no more chips. Mm -hmm. You can't bet anymore. So at this point, we're going to show our hands. Show it. And then we're just going to see the river card and see who wins. Mm -hmm. But when you show your hands like this, then it's, it's pretty much going to be a split pot. Yeah, because, split pot. Yeah, so yeah. basically, we both win. Well, we win their chips, as yeah, they put we win in. Their chips. Damn. Yeah. So this is what, our, put this is what we were hoping to do. <laughs> so. right, this is Shana's, this is mine. So we both had king three. So what happens if we have a showdown? We both have the same hand. So it's pretty much a tie. That's it. There's no flush in there anyway. So river card. So since we're all in, no more betting. That's it. River card comes out. Supposedly there's another betting round, but since we're all in, no need. Okay. And then our hands are compared. We both have three kings and jack and an eight. That's it. Split pot. We both have that. And we split the pot, so basically you take back your money, take back your own, I take back mine. But we share this. We share their money. Okay. Okay, great. <laughs>